So I don't know if you guys have been keeping up in the Roblox community lately. Not the drama community. I'm not talking about the Lisa Gaming drama, the um, uh, Uvu Cute single. If you believe in Jesus, don't scroll, etc. If you believe in Satan, don't scroll. No, I'm talking about the gaming community. Like, actual gaming content on Roblox. So lately, we've been waiting for the new Happy Pet Simulator game. The Happy Pet game from Big Games. Pet Simulator continuation. And while I was doing that, I've been playing uh, Arm Wrestle Simulator. I've been playing, lately, uh, Toilet Defense. To toilet Tower Defense. And both games, in my opinion, they don't look great. Although I must admit, I like playing the toilet game for some stupid reason. Because it's a tower defense game. But it's not good looking. It's a, it's a poorly, poorly made game in a sense, but the functionality is there. The game functions, okay? And I like that you can hatch units, like you're hatching Titanic pets from, uh, from Pet Simulator. Dude, are these crooked or is my face crooked? I hope it's the, the goggles. I need to get some new goggles. My pretty face is not crooked. Okay. You guys know Russo plays, right? He's been working on a new game. And this game actually does look pretty insane. And same with John Roblox. He's been working on... I don't know if you know John Roblox. John Roblox is a YouTuber who did the Arsenal and the original Roblox Tower Defense Simulator game. He has made his own Tower Defense game with some developers. And I believe they are calling it... Uh, Tower Defense Simulator X? Or Tower Defense X? <laughs> like Pet Simulator X? I'm tired of all these X's. Twitter changing their names to X. I think that the name is kind of bad, but the game looks great. Now, Russo has been working on a game that's uh, a mix. He claims that it's a mix between Pet Simulator X and some sort of like Pokemon game where you have to snap images of rare pets and catch them in the wild like Pokemon. I'm not really sure, but let's hear it from the man himself. And you can see for yourself that this game looks pretty nice. But is it playable? Let's take a look. Okay. It's finally time. It's finally here. Remember how I've been teasing and talking about my new game, Pet Snap Simulator? Pet Snap Simulator? Yeah, I don't know about the name, but it looks good. Let's see here. It's like a pet simulator, Pokemon Snap, Roblox game, and it's freaking dope, and it's almost here. Now, this is an exclusive sneak peek, so what I'm about to show you may shock you. Also, if you saw any of my previous sneak peeks, we kind of changed the game a lot, so you might not even know, even if you've seen some sneak peeks. This is the official exclusive sneak peek. If you guys are excited for the game, I need you to do something for me. Smash the like button on the video, of course. Okay. But more importantly, I have the game linked in the description, and it's right here. Here. Wait, where is it? Here we go. I have. But I'm pretty sure you can't play it. He says it's linked in the description, but it's just so you can favorite and follow it. So, you know, well, I'm going to do that right now. You know, I'm curious. Snap Simulator linked in the description. It is right here. Obviously, we don't have like a official thumbnail yet, um, but we have the icon and stuff, but it's by Games But Blue, Pet Snap Simulator, favorite and follow the game. That stuff really helps out. And it also gives you like straight up like right away when the game comes out you get notified and stuff so it's really really nice so let's see how many favorites we can get this and i know it's been a long let's see how many favorites it got 2287 okay not bad time coming i know i've been talking about this game for a while i didn't really super hype it up yet because i didn't want to you know get too ahead of myself but now we're looking good so i'm actually gonna run through what we have so far for the tutorial you guys can make suggestions and let us know nothing is a thousand percent final but like we're pretty much set on how the game is so we got the professor you can see right here they have a leaderboard up here snappers it's a coin leaderboard it's custom made stuff like look this is a normal Roblox um, Arthro character. And I had someone on Fiverr draw it so we could have these little character dialogue boxes. Like, we went all out to try and make this as high quality as possible. So he says, hey, you made it. You were sent here to help me gather research on this region's creatures, correct? Should I do voices for the game, by the way? Let me know. If you guys want voice no, acting. No, no. <laughs> don't add voice. To I don't want someone to read. I mean, maybe. Who knows? It's your game. Do whatever you want, Russo. Well, add a add an option to like turn off uh, voiceover. <laughs> I'll do all the voices. Here, I'll start. I'll oh, I messed up. I can't do the voices. <laughs> Here, I'll give you a starter camera to get started. So, I love Pokemon. 
So we made it like you choose your starter camera, kind of like a Pokemon. Now they all do the same stats, but it's just to give the game more variety so that some people might start with a professional cam, some people might start with the camcorder, and some might start with the Polaroid. And that's just going to give the game a unique feel. You join the game and you see So you have to use like a camera to take images of these rare pets and you get coins and diamonds every time. Uh, camcorder, professional, the one I'm using right now is somewhere in between. But it's getting old. I need a new one. So please, uh, star code RAM next time you buy Bobux so I can buy a new camera. You take pictures in this game. Like, what does that mean? Like, do you actually have like a camera? Yep. Bam! Look at that. You actually aim it, zoom in, zoom out. There's a focus. And look at that. You see the... That's freaking cool. There's a focus. And I, n I never seen anything like this in Roblox. I mean, yeah, the graphics looks similar to Pet Simulator X. You know, I wanted to showcase this, this game or his video because I'm tired of these poopy looking games filled with bugs that are popping off like arm wrestle, no offense. But, I, 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 but also at the same time, I'm like kind of like, I kind of dig. I kind of dig that games like these can become popular. It's not all about looks. Like, I enjoy playing the tower, the toilet game, the toilet tower defense. Uh, it's not a good looking game, but you know, the game functions and you know, it's kind of fun to play. Uh, so this game looks great, but will it be fun to play? And presto, level up. There's masteries and stuff too. Nice shot. So that one is a goat leap. There are many around this snappy forest just ahead and even more further into other areas in this region. All right, very nice. Uh, as you can see over here, it seems like they also have some sort of machine over here. And I thought that machine looked very nice. Called snap-ons that the game teaches uh, you about. Crafting machine, okay. Uh, later that you actually attach to your camera and you can use... Oh, I know what that machine is for. It's a machine where you charge the camera because the camera can run out of battery. Um, but he here's a tip for all you camera noobs. You get a dummy battery, like me. I have a dummy battery on this camera, so it never runs out of battery. <laughs> okay. Little effects and uh, these... It's just these things that like attach to your camera. And so like this one, for example, it zaps the pet and paralyzes them momentarily and you can get a really good picture of them. So it kind of makes it easier. There's a shiny! Oh, that's something I don't like about the inventory. Maybe you could change the color of this. The gray looks kind of bleh. What's that word I'm looking for? You know what I mean? It looks kind of boring, this color. So yeah, this inventory could change in color. If you ask me, not gray. <laughs> Make it more nice. You know what I mean? If Russo is watching, choose a different, maybe a lighter gray. Yeah. ...them momentarily, and you can get a really good picture of them. So it kind of makes it easier. There's a shiny! There's also shinies in this game, by the way. And I just found one. Did you see that shiny? <laughs> yeah. That looks very nice. I like when it takes a, when he takes a snap, and you can see, like, uh, the animation. The shiny! There's also shinies in this game, by the way. And I just found one. Look at that. That's so detailed. And all these particles. I like that very much. I love games that look good. As long as they, they're fun to play. Alright, that's all I have for Russo for now. I want to showcase um, John Roblox. But um, yeah, I think this game, I don't know really. But like, I have to try it out. Right now, I'm just thinking, okay, you take pictures of rare animals. And then what? But they have a leaderboard. They also have hoverboards. Um, you can go watch the video. I'm going to link it in the description if you want to watch the whole video yourself. And they have a shop. I mean, it's a simulator game, but I'm wondering if we take a picture or a snap of the animal, will we have the pet in our inventory? I don't think we do. So I don't think this game is about hatching pets or capturing the pets. Well, you're capturing them for the image, and I think that's about it. Anywho, let's take a look at John Roblox. Now, he's been working on a tower defense game, and this looks very similar to the game that he was popular playing, you know, here on YouTube, um, Roblox Tower Defense Simulator. I don't know if he has teamed up with the owners of that game. I don't know the name of the owner of the original tower defense game, but you can tell me if it's one of these. But you can see here, John Roblox is here as the... So maybe it's just John Roblox and he hired some devs, obviously. I don't think he has the uh, mental capacity to develop. Who knows? Maybe he does. But this game looks promising. You should take a look here. I'm rejoining. Don't worry. I'll be there in like For five seconds. <laughs> so um, they're in the lobby. And you can see the lobby itself. This looks way better than the toilet tower defense game. Way better. This is like Roblox Tower Defense Simulator. And if you go in here and see they're inside a mat. They're building farms. That's to save up coins. Yeah, well, uh, try not in the uh, late game. Wait. 
<laughs> oh, the... <laughs> I love his voice. Is it okay? Yeah. I win. I win. I promise you it's not gonna be that OP. Try it. Try it on the uh, last. La uh, Look at that, bro. Look at that animation, bro. This is insane. Bro. Hey, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> God, it's amazing everything again. Oh, 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 not this guy. Because look, at that, look at that, bro. Like, I like stuff like this. Games that are visually good looking. And I also think this game will be playable and fun to play. If I have one advice for the, the owners, or the owner, John Roblox. Um, I don't know if they have multiple owners of this game. But um, my advice, I haven't seen much. I tried to watch like 10 minutes of the stream. Um, so I don't know if they have the same features as uh toilet tower defense because i think if they want their game to pop they need to add some type of egg hatching in the lobby where you can hatch rare units and you spend a little bit of bow box or you do a combination of free to play or spending robux like that's what i like about the toilet game it mixes a bit of simulator with uh tower defense and if they don't have that in the lobby where you can hatch units um and get lucky, you know, put a percentage rare units, you know, they should add that. Because if they don't, I don't think the game will pop. And obviously they need to add trading as well. So that's just my advice for John Roblox. This game looks sick. And I just hope you add, you know, ability to hatch units and um, trade and be able to trade them. Yeah. Yeah, this looks sick. Look at this. I'll see you I will keep farming. Uh, Traz, what are you doing? Just uh, farming, right? Uh, a bit of both. I can get the laser PR like next wave. I have yeah, 5,000. Yeah. Go and get laser PR for the Pierce. We definitely need that for the spam. Wow, yeah. very nice. Well, that's all I had for now. See you guys at the next one.